put on a standing wrap. Standing wrap would be used to support the legs in the stall um, when they're under hard training. Um, or, or even for uh, bandaging an injury, swollen leg, something like that. Uh, that would, a standing wrap consists of a, um, a bandage wrap like, like this quilt style and also a flannel or something similar, um, like a trap wrap to go on the outside. I'm going to roll this up so the, the quilting is on the inside. And same thing as the polo, I'm going to start this wrap. Um, just in here behind the cannon and in front of the suspensory and just below the knee. So a lot of people get up too far and it kind of restricts the movement and also doesn't get a good snug um, hold on the on the important parts of the leg which is the ligaments and the fetlocks. So I'm going to hold that inside there and I'm going to come around. I've got some tension on this wrap. I'm not allowing the leg to twist so it won't bind. And I'm going to come around. So I'm going to wrap this on snugly and hold it in place while I get my, my flannel ready. Um, the flannel, contrary to what Apollo, um, where Apollo is started, Apollo is started up here at the top, um, but the flannel, I prefer to start it down here closer to the fetlock. And I only cover the leg one full time with a standing wrap as, instead of going all the way down the leg and all the way back up with the low. So I started at the fetlock because it's the best place to anchor. Um, and get a good snug fit where it's going to stay overnight. And I'm just going to go down over the pastern just a little bit and then right back up. So the fetlock does have a couple of wraps around and then these wraps that come up around the, the cannon and the suspensory are going to be pretty even. And then depending on the length of the horse's leg, you know, you may have couple wraps around this top too. But it should stop here at the top. So it started down here at the fetlock and again it's nice and snug. Um, at no time did I twist the leg, held the leg in place firmly and um, that'll keep her legs nice and tight. Never leave a standing wrap on longer than 24 hours. Um, maybe a maximum of 48 hours but we try and change them every 24 hours.